What's up guys? We are live action. It's Tuesday morning. This is Dr. Pine set the Premier Productivity TV expert and I'll give you guys a second to hop on here. Uh, but today I want to tell you this crazy story that just happened. I'm on the ICU uh, right now. I'm in the ICU right now. I'm actually outside enjoying some Southern California sunshine. Um, but uh, today on ICU rounds, we had a medical student with us and it was a perfect example I think for you guys to learn from. Um, whether you're a medical student, whether you're a pre-med, whether you're not even in the medical sphere, is that we can talk about being confident. Was it Zora? What is up? How you doing? Um, our, our cereal, Aisha, what's up? So we talk about uh, all the time this, this balance between confidence and competence and all these things. And it was so interesting, again, how things come together in this world. How something happens and something else happens. Well, I was reading uh, two nights ago, and I came across this great quote and this great story talking about the difference between arrogance and confidence. Uh, and in arrogance's case, uh, when you're confident, you are also competent and you perform up to that. Arrogance is when you think you don't need to prepare, and then you show up unprepared. And you guys know what I'm talking about, right? You're arrogant. Oh my gosh, I'm, I'm so great. Like, I, I, I'm so prepared for this test. I don't have to study anymore. I don't have to do these kind of things. Or like the medical student today on rounds, oh, I know this stuff so well, I know my patient so well, I don't have to really look up the numbers. And what happened today was that this medical student um, was presenting on rounds and didn't take the time to look up the extra numbers and what the numbers meant and was just going off what the computer told them was high or low and they didn't do the proper corrections and calculations and so when they went to present they looked like a complete idiot and they were saying values were normal even though they weren't normal when you take the entire picture into into context or they were saying values that were abnormal which we knew were already abnormal which were actually getting better and they were commenting on it all incorrectly and the student's arrogance level was so crazy high. Before rounds, the student was downstairs getting breakfast. He came upstairs, he's talking, ha 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 ha, eating his breakfast, drinking his coffee, when he didn't do the work he had to do to be prepared for rounds. And when he gave all this garbage presentation, my attending literally stopped rounds, and we spent 30 something minutes with my attending just grilling this guy on random topics. And I was like, golly, this is getting ugly. Um, but it was a perfect example of if you are not coming prepared every single time. Like I talked about in the stream last night on Facebook, no days on alert. If you're not prepared to bring your best, your A game every single day, you're going to get in trouble, you're gonna get exposed. And as you guys can imagine how embarrassing it is, our ISU team is 30 people. So imagine how embarrassing it must have been for this person. Uh, Leon, Mango, what is up? Imagine how embarrassing it must have been for this person to get chewed out in front of 30 people and be harangued and harassed for 30 minutes on all these different concepts, further exposing what he did not know. It's an awful way to spend your morning. And you can imagine after that, how the rest of his day is going so far. And so I just came outside to enjoy some sunshine because my ass was prepared this morning and he was not. But I just encourage you guys, don't be so arrogant that you end up in a situation that embarrasses yourself, that you end up in a situation where you lose out on opportunities. And this is the student's first day on service, and this was their opportunity to show, and as, as you guys will learn when you go to medical school or when you're doing uh, clinical rotations, the most important time is the first day. Because if you can establish the first day, it's like anything, like a job, right? If you show up and show them that you're responsible and prepared the first day, then they start to cut you some slack going down the road, right? And they start, oh, we don't have to worry about Andre. He's on top of it. And they kind of let you slide on some stuff because they give you the benefit of the doubt. But if you come in unprepared, arrogant from day one and you underperform, you set yourself up for scrutiny every single day. And this medical student is on ICU the next four weeks. It's going to be a long four weeks based on the precedents they just established. So I want you guys to learn from that, think about that, and go on from that. And I wanna remind you guys, if you guys weren't on my Facebook stream last night, you guys need to get over to my Facebook page, like my Facebook page, follow my Facebook page, The Premier Productivity Expert, because from now on, I'm actually not gonna be doing YouTube live streams. Tomorrow night is my last uh, YouTube live stream, and then after that, we're gonna be on Facebook exclusively. So you're gonna wanna make sure that you're over there on Facebook uh, getting this information. Um, but for tomorrow, as the grand finale, my exit, uh, from YouTube, I want to give you guys something very, very special. So tomorrow night, you're not going to want to miss it. 6 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. I have an extra special, special, special session um, for you guys on YouTube. And I know YouTube is a lot more accessible for some of you guys, but I don't like the an an anonymity, anonymity, anonymity. I don't like how anonymous uh, YouTube is, and so uh, I'm pulling back from YouTube. 
uh, for that reason. I want to I want to see people, know people's face, and know what's up. So you guys get on here tomorrow at 6 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. Not only will there be a great lecture, but there's gonna be a couple of announcements you guys want to hear, and a couple of special offers that you're not going to want to miss. And you're gonna be so sad if you miss the live stream and you don't catch up with what's happening. So I will see you guys tomorrow, 6 p.m. Pacific Standard Time on here, giving away great information. And, right, I'll, I'll, you know, I'll give you a little preview. I'm actually gonna be answering your guys' questions. We're gonna do an extended session, and I'm actually gonna be allowing you guys to ask more questions than ever before tomorrow. So I will see you there, 6 p.m. Pacific Standard Time, right here on YouTube. You guys have an excellent day, and as always, my website, right, www.premadproductivity.com. Later.